have about 40,000 books and 2,000 linear feet of archival materials. But each box uh, in the manuscript collections might have anywhere from 250 to 500 pieces of paper in them. The Delaware Art Museum is very much a gem. It's very unusual for a museum of this size to have a library collection and artist archives like this. The Rare Book Room has 8,000 books in there. We have the uh, personal libraries of Samuel Bancroft, Howard Pyle, John Sloan, and uh, just other general rare books. We have correspondence from the artists and to the artists. We have sketches, illustration tear sheets. Most museums this size don't have a library, let alone a rare book collection or these fantastic artist manuscript collections. Maxfield Parrish and his family went to Europe for a year uh, when he was 14 years old and he wrote these beautiful letters that he sent back to his cousin describing everything he was seeing. And the detail in these is what's really fascinating. Um, he has a top-hatted elephant sitting here at a French cafe. Um, over here there are two men smoking from a hookah with a, two little spiders. Oh, there's an unfortunate man on a barrel with a ram coming to <laughs> knock him off. And this is Ballads and Narrative Poems by Dante Gabriel Rossetti. It's from 1893. So this was uh, printed by uh, William Morris at his Kelmscott Press. And this has beautiful hand-colored illustrations. You can tell that the illustrations were colored by hand because they're different. This book is Daily Bible Illustrations. It has a painted foredge. Anyone can access the library, they just need to make an appointment.